Hi, welcome to Career Talks with Sri. My name is Sri Vidya Santosh, and in this video, you are going to get all the information regarding data science. the in course of the time that is what i would call data science to be because so many kids ask me confusions regarding data science when it comes to data science there are different types of courses different levels of courses starting from a certification program to a master degree level program so let us see what data science is Data science is all about the process of extracting clean information to form actionable insights. I'm sure that just by saying this in theory you will not understand what it is. So let's look into a practical example. If you are googling the word healthy food, I'm sure that somewhere around 4 billion results would just pop up within seconds, right? Now if somebody wants to identify how many people has done a research on healthy food within a time span of last probably 3 to 4 months that data is extractable but from there they want to analyze how many of them have further gone into the research of superfood or maybe a few people after googling healthy food they would have reached uh, some sort of a diet or some sort of an exercise or uh, some sort of a healthy living tips but if a group of people exactly want to know the mindset of people on how their thought process goes after doing a research on healthy food they need to identify the data properly right so what if somebody is giving them a data which 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 shows like 1 billion people has done a research on this and these are the results it will be so many pages right So what is the use of some company getting an information just like that? They want a proper insight of this data so that they can come to some conclusions. So data scientists are those people will who will be able to read between the lines of these information and come to a proper insightful data from which whoever has given them this duty of finding this data can come to a conclusion okay or they can get some actionable insights this is basically data science now data analysis is a word that you would probably hear along with data science and data analyst versus data scientist that is something which is confusing who is a data analyst and who is a data scientist i would say data science or data scientist is a little more um, higher version of data analysis when it comes to data analysis you are just analyzing a data but when it comes to data science or if you are a data scientist it is not just um, coming to a conclusion with the data that is already available you are also making a predictive analytics now what is predictive analytics you have a data which says that last 3 months things were like this hmm? now if somebody is forming a conclusion out of it that is called a data which is concluded from the data that is available now if you want to analyze that data and predict a pattern that can happen in the next 3 months that is called predictive analysis right now this predictive analysis is done by data scientist so data analysis is actually a part of data science wherein data science is little more of a wider version hope you got it it has got prescriptive analytics predictive analytics also machine learning for pattern discovery and making predictions now these are the main things that you will learn in data science obviously there will be languages that you have to learn with regard to that who are is interested in mathematics statistics and related subjects you will obviously find data science to be interesting now if you are looking for a course option in data science you have various options starting from a certification program you have certifications you have diploma programs that can be done right directly after plus 2 you have bachelor degree that can be completed after your plus 2 you have master degree program you have pg diploma program you have msc level program so 
different types of programs in data science is available so who should go for what that totally depends on your interest level and what you want to become and let me tell you one thing clearly uh, most of the time even if you learn any of these programs from an institute or a college or a university the practical experience or a practical exposure in this industry will only help you to climb the ladder even if you have got a lot of certifications obviously the certifications and degrees will matter for you when you climb the ladder but apart from that you need to have practical exposure just with theoretical exposure in this particular subject you will not be able to do anything with that so always remember this eligibility obviously depends on the type of the course that you are taking if you are looking for a pg diploma you should have completed your bachelor's degree if you are looking for a bachelor's degree in this subject then you should have completed your plus 2 and uh, just a diploma program with plus 2 level you can pursue certification programs are also mostly like that so it all depends on what type of a program that you are planning to opt and the duration of this program is anywhere from 3 months to 3 years if it is a certification program there are some certifications which you can get even in 3 months time but just with that certification i will not suggest you to pursue further with those certifications directly after plus 2 because it will not help you further uh if it is if you are going for a certification program better do it after completing your pg and all then it is fine directly after plus 2 if you are doing a certification in data science just with that you will not be able to get into any higher level post okay now uh, you need not pursue data science as a bachelor degree program directly after 12th you can even go for your bachelor's in mathematics or statistics or even computer science and then further get specialized in data science for your master's degree that is also possible now there is no particular entrance examination for data science none of the universities conducts an entrance examination for getting into this program and some of these places they will do a small test just to see whether you have got an interest in this that's it it's, it cannot be called a uh, je level or neet level ka entrance examination and all it's a small test that they will conduct to know your passion towards that particular subject that is it so these are the things that you should keep in mind uh, if you are planning to pursue a career in data science if you have any confusions regarding this program please feel free to get in touch with us through comments and also make sure you share this video to your friends so that they also get benefited see you in another video goodbye